Good morning, everyone. Is everyone excited to be here? Yeah. Woo! Well, I'm Karen Snow, head of U.S. listings here at NASDAQ, and it's my great pleasure to welcome LKQ's president and CEO, Dominic Sarcone, to market site to celebrate LKQ Corporation's 25th business anniversary, and I think that deserves a round of applause. <laughs> I'd also like to extend a welcome to LKQ's management team, employees, family, and friends. We're excited that you could all join us right here at the crossroads of the world in Times Square as we get set to ring today's opening bell. Founded in 1998, LKQ is the leading provider of alternative aftermarket specialty salvage and recycled auto parts to repair and accessorize vehicles. With operations in over 25 countries throughout North America, Europe, and Taiwan, LKQ offers its customers a broad range of replacement systems and equipment to repair and accessorize automobiles, trucks, recreational, and performance vehicles. NASDAQ was thrilled to launch LKQ's IPO in October of 2003. Since LKQ has surpassed significant milestones and is now the only supplier of alternative parts for the automotive collision and mechanical repair industry with a network presence serving most major markets in the US and Canada. Dominic, we know this is a team effort, so congratulations again to you and your entire team on all that you've achieved together. NASDAQ is exceptionally proud to be your partner, and we look forward to celebrating many more milestones with you. And now please join me in welcoming President and CEO of LKQ Corporation, Dominic Zarcone, to the podium. Good, good morning, everyone. Again, my name is Nick Sarconi, and I am the very proud CEO of LKQ Corporation. And I would like to thank NASDAQ for hosting us here this morning to ring the opening bell. It's going to be a great event. Our founder had a vision to consolidate the auto salvage industry. And in 1998, he and a few of his partners pulled some of their money together to begin acquisitions in the industry. By 2003, they had built a business that was $300 million in revenue, but needing capital to continue to grow, they decided to take the company public, and in October of 2003, the company completed its IPO right here on NASDAQ. The market value of the company at that time was just over $200 million. Now, Don was a visionary. He was a big thinker. Uh, he lived large and had big dreams, but never would he ever anticipated LKQ in 2023. Today, we're an organization with $13 billion of revenue, 1,500 locations spread out over 25 countries across the globe, 46,000 employees, and as of yesterday, we had a market capitalization of $15.6 billion. That's a 78 times increase from the original IPO valuation. Not bad for a company that distributes auto parts. So, uh, I would like to thank all the employees of LKQ, past and present, for everything you do to make our company great. And as we say at LKQ, be LKQ proud. Thank you. Congratulations again. And here are the opening bells on Wall Street and on Bay Street here in Toronto at the NASDAQ. LKQ Corporation is celebrating its 25th anniversary. It's an auto parts company at the New York Stock Exchange. It's time now for the first 15.